The Florida Current, an online news service smartly covering politics and policy. Subscribe for free daily alerts at thefloridacurrent.com. Florida's governor is touting a record budget featuring tax and fee reductions. $500 million of tax breaks uh, for Florida families. Put money in back back in Florida families' pockets. The legislature passed a near $400 million tag fee tax break, but they're also asking for $400 million for education spending. Well, the millage rate's the same. Uh, millage rate was not increased, but the assessed values of property uh, throughout Florida increased. Florida partners with school districts for what's called a required local effort for K-12 through spending. The state is raising local contributions from about $7.8 billion to about $8.2 billion this year. The tax rate isn't going up, but property owners are on the hook for the additional $400 million. Bucks. Property owners will be paying about 5% more towards school property taxes than they did last year. School districts can't say no because they can lose out on state funding. The state is increasing its contribution also, but only by 2%. Florida Tax Watch says the legislature had options to help out owners. The legislature could have applied a rollback rate, which would have pretty much retained the amount of property taxes that we're collecting. They would have increased slightly due to the increase of uh, property values, uh, but we certainly wouldn't have seen an increase in revenue. Lawmakers had the option to put more state revenue into the deal to offset rising costs, but they didn't, choosing to save it instead. Reporting in Tallahassee, I'm Matt Gelkin.